What's up YouTube? It's Jose from Bait and Bougie and I am coming to you from New Freaking Mexico. Yes, normally I'm in around the Nor Nor, the Moor and Norman area, but I'm on a uh, business trip. I'm in Hobbs, Hobbs, New Mexico, south Oldfield town. So, I'm out here for training and uh you'd be absolutely crazy if you didn't think i'd not bring a fishing pole so come to find out there's a small lake about 1.6 miles called green meadow lake and from what i understand there's a little bit of bass but mainly stocked catfish so i'm gonna go check it out guys uh when it comes to stocked catfish in a real small pond slash lake i like to use hot dogs with garlic so I'm gonna use hot dogs with garlic powder. I've been letting them sit for a little while. I've just got a, one small pole. Like I said, I packed really light this time around. But I'm just gonna go for there. So, see you guys out there in the water. Well, this is the place. Um, damn good looking spot. Apparently there's bass here. Catch and release lake for largemouth bass. Man, I'd love to have one of these houses. Look, you got residential homes all around here. Families fishing. Awesome. Huh. Two catfish because practice catch and release fishing and fish all day. Hey, catch, release, repeat, right? Awesome. Let's get rigged up and do our thing. Bigger one. Ooh. See that? Fat. Yeah, look at it. bigger now, not the even size, at least.
Ah, oh, crap. I need to. Ah. Bastard. Damn it. So I'm back in my hotel now. I went out there to, and I had a pretty good time. I was only out there for about two and a half hours. I caught two catfish and then hooked on to two bass. But as soon as I saw color, shot the hook out. Um, there was a couple guys well, one guy. There was one guy who was bass fishing, and he actually caught two bass. So at that time, I said, forget it. You know, I want to try and catch some bass. So I went ahead and went with a, tried the wacky rig, a Senko, for a little while. Didn't have much luck, and that's when I went to just a weightless Texas rig. And that's when I was getting the hits. Started to get a little too hot out there, so I decided to come back, eat some breakfast and everything. I might go out later on today, but we'll see. Thanks for watching. If you like it, please subscribe, like this video, and even though I haven't been cranking out videos like I should be because I've been traveling, when I get back to Oklahoma, I'll definitely be cranking out some more. But again, thank you for watching.